everyone. If I'm not yet subscribed to my channel, kindly touch the red subscribe button. Also touch the notification bell so you'll be notified when I have a new video. Also share this video. God bless you. Hi everyone, how have we been? This is Blessing Yagwina. If you're not subscribed to my channel, can you subscribe and be blessed? Amen. We'll be praying today. It's good to pray. Prayer is so important. It's so important. Praise God. We'll be praying for racial unity, peace, forgiveness, justice, and salvation. Amen. Let's get started. Hallelujah. Let's look at the book of Genesis 127. It says, So God created man in his own image, in the image of God created he him. Men and female created he them. Praise God. You see, he says God created man in his own image. Amen. He didn't create different men with different colors and different images. That means we are all one. Praise God. We are all from the same source. Whether we believe it or not, that's the truth. Let's pray for racial unity. That all men will come to know that we are from the same source. That we are all one. In Jesus' name. Let's pray. Father God, we thank you in Jesus' name. We pray for racial unity in the name of just we pray that all men will come to realize that we came from the same source, that we came from you, that we are all one in the name of Jesus Christ. Which all things are possible. We don't know why you're going to do it, oh God. We'll pray towards the heart of men all over the world. That we, be, we know that we are one, that we be love amongst all of us in the name of Jesus Christ. Father God, we bless your name because you are a mighty God. You can do all things. God, we pray that there be, Father God, uh, uh, nothing about racism all over the world, but that there be promotion about unity. Unity, racial unity in the name of Jesus Christ. Let all men realize, lay down on people that man came from God. From one source, and we were made your image. Just one man, not many men with different colors, with different images. Do it, oh God, that you touch the heart of soul, touch the heart of people, oh God, to give their lives to Christ. And, and that way, they will even know better. Thank you, Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We don't know how we're going to do it, but we know it's possible. If God means that God will cause many people to be born again, God will do it. Hallelujah. But we are, we are going to do our own part by praying for racial unity. As we are praying now, we will continue to pray. Praise God until we see that things are good. Amen. Now we're going to be praying for peace. And we are going to be praying for peace. Let's read Leviticus 26 says, And I will give peace in the land, and ye shall lie down. And none shall make you afraid. And I will read evil beasts out of the land. Neither shall the sword go through your land. Amen. Let's pray for America, for peace. For Nigeria, for China, everywhere over the world for peace. Praise God. Most in America today, what there is um, uh, violence. There's peaceful protest for what's happened recently. But there's also some people that are doing violence. Praise God. Let's pray this violence. Let's for our leaders in America to have wisdom from God to undo this violence. Not to escalate it, but to make things better. To make peace reign. In Jesus' name. Let's pray. Masata kason teri bozinde lita kabosa talabonda rakita rabose reboze riko to fara in heaven we pray for peace in Jesus name. We say we will give peace to our land, oh God. We say we will sleep, we will not be afraid, oh God. We say the sun will not go to our land, oh God. We will pray for peace in America. Go in the name of Jesus Christ. Let there be peace in America. Or give wisdom, oh God, to the, to the leaders of America to, to, to bring peace. And not violence in the name of Jesus Christ. The violence already started, but we'll put a stop to it in the name of Jesus Christ. We we'll build every spirit of violence. Get out of America in the name of Jesus Christ. We we'll also pray for that nations of the world, that nations of the world, pray for peace, oh God, peace, oh God, all over the world, oh God, by your power, oh God, have mercy, oh God, intervene, oh God, Mata Shata Kaba Sontana Vasta. Let peace reign in all nations. Thank you, Father, that the world may, may, may prevail. In the nations, and the gospel may prevail in the nation. Thank you, Lord God, in Jesus' name, Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Now, I'm going to pray the next prayer point.
for forgiveness. Let's read Matthew 6, 14 to 15. For if ye forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if ye forgive not men their trespasses, neither will your Father forgive your trespasses. Amen. Let's pray for forgiveness. Let us be hurt. We, we forgive. Hurt by racism, hurt by anything that they have the grace to forgive. In Jesus' name, that God will give them the grace to forgive. Hallelujah. Whatever we say, if we forgive, we will be forgiven. Let's pray. In the name of Jesus Christ, Master, get the devil so many people. Let's get the devil. Send 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 the they cannot do it by their own self, but it is easy with you. I will give them the grace of God to forgive, oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, because forgiveness is sweet, forgiveness is good, forgiveness is freedom. Oh, pray, oh God, for forgiveness, oh God. Touch every heart that has been heavy, that has been so wounded, oh God. Heal every wounded heart, oh God. Comfort those, oh God, that have been that, that are mourning, oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ. Let there be forgiveness, oh God, in America, in all nations. Thank you, Lord God, for forgiveness, for the grace to forgive. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Now, we're going to pray for justice. Let's read Proverbs 21, 15. So, when justice is done, it is joy to the righteous, but terror to evil doers. When justice is done, it is joy to the righteous, but terror to evil doers. Justice is good. It's the will of God. It's not because of the person and the wrong alone, but for other people to learn that, oh, this thing is bad, therefore they withdraw from it. When there's no justice, it's very bad. That means people will think, oh, this is okay, I will also do it too. So they pray for justice in America for what's happening today, and justice for everything all over the world. That God will intervene in cases and there will be justice. So as such evil that was done, we don't repeat, we don't keep on repeating itself. We don't pray. Justice is not because you do not forgive. No. Justice is just good. But the person that did wrong tomorrow may receive justice. Yes, but may give his life or life to Christ tomorrow and become a new creature. But justice is good because it will help other people to, to refrain. From setting us. So I'm going to pray for justice now. For what's happened in America recently. The case in America now. That there will be justice. And there will be justice. In all cases. All over the world. In Jesus name. Amen. We pray for that way in the name of Jesus Christ. For justice, oh God. And the God of justice. We pray for your justice to prevail. In this case, oh God. That what's happening in America right now. That's all over the news, oh God. And let justice prevail. In the name of Jesus Christ. Let justice prevail, oh God. In all countries, all over the world, where there are issues, where there are cases, Father God, because when justice prevails, the righteous rejoice and the evil doers are terrorized. In the name of Jesus Christ, let there be justice, oh God. Intervene, oh God. Step in, oh God. Step in, oh God. Touch the heart of judges, touch the heart of leaders. Let there be justice at all times, oh God. In America, in other countries, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father God, for your prayers. Thank you, your honor, God. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Justice. Praise God. Amen. Hallelujah. I may not make sure what's happening right now in America. I don't like repeating some things that, you know, that are so not good to hear. But I know you all know what's happening all over the news at this time. Praise God. Amen. In case you watch the video, uh, in maybe years to come, or something, like just know that it's about racism. Praise God. Hallelujah. Now I want to pray for salvation. There is a very popular scripture, John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him shall not die, but have everlasting life. Amen. Salvation. Praise God. 
is a life on my um, agenda, but not the least. But with salvation, many people will not be racist. They will know better. Let's pray that many people will be saved in the name of Jesus. All over the world, that the gospel will grow and prevail all over the world. That people will rise up to preach the gospel in the name of Jesus. Christ. That people that are blinded by the devil, that, that skin, the skin will fall off their eyes, and they will see that Jesus Christ is Lord. They will see that, that God is real. Let's pray, Master Kataba Oh, we will pray for salvation all over the world for men that are not saved, oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ. Let them receive your word. In the name of Jesus Christ, let this people, let their eyes be open to see that Jesus Christ is real and the devil has closed their eyes. When and, and their minds, and their, and their minds be open, oh God. Rapa, Tuka, Santa, Bashanta. There will be salvation, oh God, in America. They will what grow and prevail in America. They will what grow and prevail in Nigeria. They will what grow and prevail in China. They will what grow and prevail in India. They will what grow and prevail in London. They will what grow and prevail in every city, in every nation, in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father, for in our cross. We bless your name in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. That's all I've come to pray for today. If you are there, not born again. Today is your day. Do not add in your heart. Jesus Christ is real. It's not a mere story. God is real. There is God. So people say there's no God. That was the fool says in his heart there's no God. There is God. Hallelujah. If there's no God, who made the heavens on the earth? There is God. So now you are not born again. Say after me. Say, Lord Jesus. Today, I accept you into my heart. Be my Lord. Be my Savior. I believe you died on the third day you rose from the dead. Thank you for dying for me. Thank you, Father, for sending your son. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. So that prayer, not born again. Go to the Bible teaching church. The person will teach you the Bible because the Bible contains the word of God so you can grow. But the Bible is the food of the Spirit so you can grow. Hallelujah. If you are looking for churches, you can ask me, I, will, I, will, I, will, I can recommend for you where you can be established and be taught. Thank you for joining me. Subscribe to my channel for more of God's word and prayers. God bless you. See you next time.